You're watching Fox 13 News. Let's connect. Intermountain Medical Center's Heart Institute's My Heart Challenge going strong again this year. Yeah, there's right? 13 participants. They're all from nonprofit organizations taking the challenge to improve their heart health. Fox 13's Dave Nemeth joins us. We always like it when you're here, Dave. Hi, Dave. I, I kept waiting for the booming forward, but it didn't. It's wrong. Wrong story. Yeah, you're not. You're not booming. Not this yet. is My Heart yeah. Challenge, right? <laughs> Every year, Intermountain Medical Center Heart Institute does conduct the My Heart Challenge, not just to help participants develop better eating and exercise habits but also to share their knowledge with the general public so that we might all become more heart healthy. Hi, Andrea. How are you? What are you doing? Have a good weekend. I did have a good weekend, and I've been down here working out. Good for you. Yeah. Carla Pardini is the director of programming at the Jewish Community Center in Salt Lake City. The center offers a number of activities to help patrons keep moving and improve their cardiovascular performance. It is a community center for all people. Um, it doesn't really matter who you are, where you come from. Um, what you like to do, everyone is welcome at the JCC. Carla's husband passed away three years ago following a heart transplant, adding to her resolve to improve her heart health. So she decided to take on the Intermountain Medical Center Heart Institute's 100-day My Heart Challenge. It's really serious business for me. Like some of my younger colleagues that are 20 and can eat french fries and tater tots all day, I can't do that anymore. Exercise physiologist Megan Klein has been working with the My Heart Challenge participants, and she encourages making it a group activity. Whether it's walking with people at work to keep you motivated or checking on your Fitbit, it's nice to have that social component of this to keep you motivated and active throughout the day. Megan urges everyone to get up, find an activity you enjoy, maybe buy a Fitbit, a pedometer, or another device to help monitor your movements. It's a really easy way to kind of progress your activity without um, adding in some, adding in a gym membership or a bike or other equipment. It's, um, it's nice and easy and everyone can keep track of it. Intermountain Medical Center Heart Institute has helped many people understand the value of staying active. As for Carla Pardini, she's taking the opportunity the My Heart Challenge presents and has jumped in with both feet, adding it's a challenge for life. I feel really engaged with it. I feel really excited about the challenge itself um, and realizing that you really it isn't for 100 days. If you really want to have a healthy heart, you have to really just do this. Such a great, uh, great challenge. I, lo uh, I, yeah. I love the whole program. Now, the winner will receive a $1,000 uh, check for their nonprofit organization, and you can follow the progress of the contestants as we bring you these weekly updates right here on Fox 13. Fun to track their progress. Thanks, yeah. Dave. Yeah, they're doing great.